Hey, it's Pokemon Fan here, and today I'll be uh, doing a video on how to screen record on your new 3DS XL. This only works on new 3DS right now uh, with uh, NTR custom firmware. Uh, I'll have a link description for the NTR 3.4, but when you load it up and everything, it says 2.4 for some reason. But this is all you need to do is that these two, the boot NTR.ca and the NTR.bin goes in your on the Rudy Gear 3DS, and then you have to install boot ntr.cia through whatever method you have and then you're going to need ntr debugger and you have to go to ntr client now after you do this um when you load up ntr the first time it's going to get out and stuff like that uh you'll have to uh go to fbi and push y until you find your ip because you'll need um, the ip address to make this work and then you have to enable uh, enable debugger on the NCR. And when you do the, the enable debugger, make sure when you press X and Y to open it that you're not near no games or anything because if you do it, it won't work. So what you have to do is that I already have mine, and you have to type in connect, and then you have to type in whatever your IP is plus uh, the 8000, then you click enter, and then it's going to say that, and then you click remote, type in remote play, and then click enter again. Your screen on your DS will go a weird color, like purple and blue, and then from here, you can see everything. Um, as you can see, it, it is kind of buggy. Um, the only sad thing is, is that it will not play Omega Earth, Sapphire X and Y. Um, it will load up the game as far as I've seen so far it will load it up but as for the gameplay itself it won't load up past the home screen it will crash for some reason or it won't crash it just won't load it up but um, if you try to do this uh, see the screen just goes black so I don't know if there's gonna be a new update or anything for this to fix this issue but when you get out of X it'll go back to your regular screen um, but the only bad thing is uh, it will play this. I don't know if exactly will play or not because sometimes with NCR it will crash if you try to play more than one game, which this it hasn't so far. Um, like I said, it doesn't record uh, screen uh, the sound, so hopefully he'll make a new version that will play it. See, I like the volume on just to pick anything up. Uh, everything in, will be in the description below to find out how to do this. And um, the only way to actually record the actual screen, there's no way to record it through NTR. Like, there's no button on the NTR view or anything to record it. I've tried everything. Uh, even pressing NTR, there's nothing to... There's nothing to take a screenshot, and that's it. After that, there's nothing else you can do. So you're going to need something like debut video capture or some kind of capture software to record it through your laptop. Um, and once this fully is available... Like, I'll show the frame rate's actually not bad. I'll do a Pokemon battle real quick. Uh, but once... Okay, so I can't really do anything right now. So let me go to a different game. Uh, but um, I'll show Kirby Fighters real quick on it because, well, Kirby Fighters is kind of laggy, but it does go through it really good. But Pokemon XY and Omega of Sapphire, it does not work right now for some reason. Like, it has really bad issues with it. Like, it does have a time delay with certain things, but it will work. Like, it does Kirby Fighters really good, which is what I like about it. It does really good with Kirby Fighters. Some other games, as you can see, it does have a line through it. But this is just for people that don't have the money for capture cards. It does lag. Um, you can press the X and Y button and uh, go to the... and change it to the bottom one, which is the 804 one and then you get out of it and it will make the frame rate faster but actually it's doing really good right now and you know it's really fun to do this the only thing I have a problem with is that it won't play Pokemon X and Y it'll, it'll do the home screen and that's pretty much all it will do but besides that's just really fun to use if you want to record like something like doesn't take a lot of I guess MP whatever to make it run fast. So until further updates, I will be doing recordings for my uh, Pokemon Yellow and stuff gameplay. Um, and in the future, if they do an update, I will release an update video for it for the better software. So if you just video, give it a like. Uh, Pokemon fan signing out.